Hello there everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Elliot Webber and it is the first of two videos today. Uh, I decided to split these two into two videos, but yes, over the past few days, um, we've had some announcements of BTCC just a week before Media Day next Wednesday. It has been announced that Ash Hand will be debuting in the BTCC with Power Max Racing alongside Michael Creed. So, let's get straight into this. Yes, guys, that is right. Ash Hand will be making his BTCC debut with Power Max Racing alongside Michael Creed in the Vauxhall Astra Hybrid. And, I mean... I did not expect this. I don't think anyone expected this. I feel like a lot of people thought that Chris Smiley would be getting the second seat. I, th I, um, I personally predicted that Dan Zelos or Lewis Kent would be getting the seat. But of course, Lewis Kent uh, is now doing a second year of T, uh, a, a second year, a fourth year of TCR, and Dan Zelos is rumored to return to the Mini Challenge for a title defense. Um, but yeah, Ash Ash Hand. This is something that I'm not. I'm not upset about because Ashand is a very good driver. As we know, he has had multiple years on the Toka Package, a Toka Package alumni racing in the Renault Clio Cup for multiple years. And of course, it's the 2019 British GT champion racing with Aston Martin TF Sport. Um, Ash is a phenomenal racer. We have seen that countless times, especially in the Clio Cup. While he never won the championship, he has carried that number one and he has also won multiple races, contended for the championship. Let's not forget 2015, he was up against Ash Sutton, he was up against Ann Wharton Eels, he was up against Paul Rivette. He has gone up against some of the legendary Clear Cup drivers and he's performed very well against them. So this is a very good, very good signing by Power Max Racing and it is great to see Ash um ash hand get his long-awaited debut i'd say because ash i think has been deserving of a touring car seat for a long time of course he's gone down the gt route the past few years however with that gt experience and of course with that many years of clear cup experience i have no doubt in my mind that ash hand will be a very competitive racer of course hello dad your favorite driver <laughs> oh that's that's an inside joke for those of you who don't know um but yeah, Ash Hand, phenomenal to see him on the grid. And let me know what you guys think in the comments below. What are your predictions for the new rookie? We now have three rookies on the grid. Um, something that hasn't happened for a long, long time now, of course. Potent you could say four with, of course, Ricky Collard as well being announced. And that is a video I will get into. That will be the next video after this one. Um, so yeah, but yeah, Ash, Ash, Ash Hand. I I keep saying Ash Sutton. Oh my gosh, it's Ash Hand now. Now we've got two Ashes on the grid, so we've got we've got to get used to that. Ash Hand, Ash Sutton, Ash Sutton, Ash Hand. Yeah, something to get used to. But yeah, guys, let me know what you think in the comments below. Are you happy with Ash Hand joining the BTCC for the first time this year? And of course, what are your predictions for the rookie? Will he be competitive, or will he sadly be near the back due to, of course, the Vauxhall Astra? It's the oldest car on the grid now. Potentially the slowest. Of course, I don't really see Power Max being very competitive. However, of course, they have got a very good lineup with Hand and Creasy. So, yeah, let me know, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Will Power Max be competitive with this lineup and in the new era of hybrids? Um, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. If you are new around here, be sure to subscribe, like the video, and share with your mates because it does help my channel grow. Because, of course, we are on the road to 100 subscribers. Of course, my plan is to hopefully have 100 subscribers by the end of the year. So let but anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.